lead. I know you did, but that's okay. She does. She follows my lead on a lot of things. <laughs> oh, <laughs> anyway, hair. listen. If you're just joining us, we've got some great sewing tips for you during the show today. It's all part of National Craft Month. Did you know that by using fresh thread, old thread dries up and becomes brittle and can cause poor stitch quality and frustrating thread breaks? That is a tip from Darlene Cahill. I want to remind you too that we also have this to share with you. Always thread your machine with the presser foot up. This ensures that the thread will be seated properly in the tension discs. One more little tip, and that is to buy the foot parade. If you do that, there are 10 feet and 10 projects, and you know, we brag about all the pressure feet we give you. Learn how to use them properly with Darlene Cahill. She's cute, she's adorable, she's the educator and the teacher. She'll teach you how to sew. Okay, this is my present and Darlene's present to you today. We've never done it before. This is gonna be really big. I don't know if it's possible, but it is conceivable that we have 1,300 of these machines they could all sell out in this hour because it is the single lowest price we have ever in 37 years as the pioneer of electronic retailing offered you on a commercial grade heavy duty sewing machine from Singer. Yes, a $279.94 value today for $199.95. We went to the top and we got it on five flex payments for you for $39.99, free shipping and handling, and it comes with extra value added uh, pressure feet that you don't get normally. Now this is the basics you always get from um, Singer when you buy a heavy duty. You're gonna receive the spool caps, the felt discs that keep your thread from spinning around, the needles. You're gonna receive the auxiliary spool pin, the general pressure feet. These are the basics. The bobbins and screwdriver, you get those. These are extras. Extra, extra. Cording, gathering foot. This one is unlabeled. Oh, it's the darning embroidery free motion. Darning and embroidery free motion yes. foot. Mm -hmm. See, I didn't know that. Well, the label was too big to put on there. The stretch stitch. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Good excuse. And the rolled hem foot. I've actually used this one. Okay, when you get these extra. If you were to purchase this all separately at Singer, it would cost you close to $300. This is like $200, it's crazy. It really is crazy. It's a customer pick, it is and probably always will be because it's their number one selling machine here at HSN. At $199.95, you would pay just $180 alone for the machine, plus all those extra presser feet start adding up. 25 wow. and 20 and 20 and 20 and $15. So that's how you got to that. Plus, you know what, we're the experts on FlexPay because we originated it. Yeah, free shipping. Wow. Because we didn't do that in five flex payments at $199 ever. I don't think it's ever been that good. So we think oh. 1,300 of these machines could be packaged up for guys, for gals, for your daughter, okay. for whoever Here we go. that's in, like, you know, let's going to like fashion school. Yep. Let's start at the beginning. Leather, excuse me, denim, eight layers, two, four, six, eight. And heavy home decor fabric, eight layers, bonded fabric. Then silk. Very sheer. Now, two layers of leather, heavy farmer's leather. And there it goes. And now, right into lead. That's right, we just sewed lead because we want you to know this is not a wimpy machine. It might be a wimpy price, but it's a heavy duty machine that will help you with all of your home decor needs. If it can sew through lead and two layers of leather and eight layers of denim, what do you have in your environment that this is not going to be able to handle? In your home decor world, your outdoor patio furniture, the covers for your, your, um, for, uh, your furniture and, and your, your grill. Oh, your grill, that's a good one. And your tent and your awnings and all of those outdoor oh, you, things. You won't believe what yeah. you can do with it. I mean, if you want to make a canopy, you can make a canopy for the front door and, and sew it in canvas. Those UV, you know, uh, resistant, you know, uh, nice. canvas materials you can buy. By using this machine, it's a heavy duty denim. Listen, you'll you'll make you'll save enough in one year. One year, probably if you've got a family of six and they're always buying jeans and always having you go out and you know go to the tailor yeah. to have things altered, you can sew. Do your own hems. Perfect segue into my jean demo. Of course. Okay, so we have the bottom of a pair of jeans, and you know what happens when you cut off this bottom? The bottom that's already you know been rubbed on the rocks and they make it look old and you buy it like that and it looks like they're not brand new. Well, when you go to hem them and you cut that off, they look kind of nerdy because that goes away and then you're like, oh, I don't like the look anymore. Well, now you can keep that look. I'm going to show you how. You use this machine. You utilize different features. The free arm. 
the piping and zipper foot on the left hand side because this can attach either way. It can attach on the left as you see there or it can attach as you see here on the right. But we're going to attach it on the left because we want to get nice and close to the edge. You're going to hem, you're going to cut the pants the way that you want them and make Make an allowance for a half inch hem and then a half inch fold over when you're finished, okay? And then you slip this onto your free arm. I'm gonna take a second here to organize it. Slip it onto the free arm, put it under the foot. And now, watch what you can do. You can move your needle over because you have a, a needle position, right? You can move it over left or right. And so I'm moving it over. Plus you have three different built-in needle positions, but I'm just gonna move that over and we're just gonna start sewing. Now you won't wanna ram it all of a sudden. Let's give it a little bit of grace over the hump. It's gonna be fine because this is the heavy duty machine and there's some other features I wanted to share with you on this machine such as you're going to notice the stainless steel bed. It's never going to rust and it resists scratches so it won't snag even your most delicate lingerie bill. And it also has a top loading drop in bobbin. So you don't have to worry about those cumbersome bobbins and having to slide the bobbin into the machine. You don't need to be a surgeon to make the machine work. So you just saw hemming a pair of jeans. We went around in a circle. You didn't have to wrestle with it because we're sewing round, but we didn't sew it on a flat surface. And then when you take that over to your iron and you give it a press, haha, -ha, it looks like you didn't do anything to them. And now they can fit you properly and you can keep the bottom intact. So there's a way to hem your jeans. I love that. And the tailors charge a lot of money oh, to no, do no. that they for you. They charge 20. Listen right. to me, because I've done it. 20 to $25. Darlene trained me on the 160th anniversary sewing machine. I'm not going to the tailor anymore to have jeans right. altered. Because if they do a removed hem and they move it up like that, oh my God, it's ridiculous. But listen, yeah. just simmer down about this. This is a big deal. I'm telling you to simmer down at home because I know that you're getting a little hysterical over this price. I don't blame you. If you Google it, you're not going to find it for less with the value added accessories. We are outdoing ourselves for National Craft Month. I was shocked when I came in and I talked to Donna, who was our show writer, and she said, Bill, for your show, this hour only, only for the next 25 minutes, can you get this home on five flex payments? and at a savings of $50 off. We offered this originally at $299, then it went to $249. It is now $199.95, and it's the heavy duty. This is not like a beginner machine. This is a, bit well, it's a beginner machine that's good for the beginner that wants to sew heavy duty stuff. It's mechanical, it's dial a stitch, it's aluminum frame, so you'll have fewer skip stitches. It has a support bottom, a nice, uh, I call them baffles under here. If you've ever, you know, looked at the big ships and how they have the weight distributed so they don't tip over. That's what this does. It won't tip over when you're working on those heavy pieces of um, heavy overcoats. Maybe you're working on a big comforter. You've got that, that uh, extra security down there. You also have the accessory storage tray. So all of your little feet will fit here at your fingertips. Nice to have them right there when you need them. And I just snapped on the buttonhole foot and I slid on the back on that sliding carrier a little button first before we started and now on the side see this little white button here I'm gonna pull that down watch pull it down oh not that one this one this one you pull it down and then it says push so I'm gonna push it towards the back then you are completely set up for a buttonhole so check this out Bill you find your spot mm -hmm. you go ahead and see I love this because Singer makes this, this so down. easy people think that doing a buttonhole is a, a nightmare oh no not with Singer and not with a presser oh, foot you have to dial it up so I'm dialing the buttonhole graphic, and then up here I dial the buttonhole length, and then up here I decide if I want it narrow or wide. Narrow would be about a five. And then over here, my needle position is still center. I am ready to go. Hold the tail, not oh, too it. strong, but right. just don't let it get caught, carried away with you, and let it start. And it's going to make a fantastic buttonhole. I mean, a perfect buttonhole. Perfect. Perfect for the button on that sliding carrier on the back of the foot now, anyway. How many of you have a jacket where you're like, I Look. wish there was another button on this jacket, and then you start thinking about it, and you're One like, step. yeah, but there's no extra buttonhole. You could make your own. Do your own. 
Now, here's something else you can do. You can sew the button on. Mm -hmm. So now I'm gonna take that same button off the sliding carrier, and I'm going to remove the buttonhole foot and snap on my button attachment foot. And that's this foot right here. And these are all feet that are on that DVD, the foot parade. And I go into much detail about how they're, what the anatomy of the foot is and how to use it and different applications for it. <laughs> the because, anatomy of the foot. Mm -hmm. Because just, there's a lot of different ways. I just love the name of it. Well, that tells me you haven't watched my DVD, Bill. No, I haven't. No. I'm going to be okay. honest with you. I don't want to lie about that, but I know okay. something tells me after I come to your shop. You're, you're going to be watching it. Watch it. Okay. That's so going to be my entertainment night with popcorn and a beer. <laughs> okay. Well, I'll join you. Okay, so take a look at this. Now we have a zigzag stitch. I'm dialing the zigzag because I want it to be exactly the right width of the space on the eyes of the button. Now my length, I want zero. Do not move. We're going to stay, stay put. And the width, I want to be... As I said, the same width as the eyes on the button. And it looks like I got it right there at about four. So it's all set. And once you set it by moving that hand wheel towards you and making sure it's in the right position, there it goes. See that? And now I go to the next two holes. Do it again because this was a four hole buttonhole. A button. There you go. I never knew, honest to goodness, now, because I went the other day to have a button put on my jacket. Could you even have found a little I, thread by now? I swear to you, I did not know that you could put a button on with a machine. I thought you had to do it by hand. We just made a bar tack, but we also attached a button. There's different ways to tie it off. I show that in the video. That is unreal. And there you have that. a button. You attached it. And First you made the button hole, then you put on the button. And of course, they'd be on two separate pieces, but for the sake of television, I'm just showing you this fast. And there you see yeah, how easy would, that, this is to That's something I would have done intentionally and by mistake. Okay, listen, this is your opportunity. Let me give you an update. We have 20 minutes left together, you, Darlene, myself, and uh, the rest of our customers watching. This is your chance. This is truly your chance, even if you're not interested in buying this to do sewing for clothing, but you want it for crafting. It's National Craft Month. You will not believe the projects are endless. Darlene has a blog, by the way, on hsn.com, where she's always there educationally to teach you about new projects that are forthcoming and that are available. You've got to also have this, the Foot Parade. And that is her DVD that will teach you how to use all the extra value-added presser feet that we're talking about during the show. But we've never done this before. It's a customer so pick, great. and you're getting this for $199.95, free shipping, and for this hour only, only for the next 21 minutes, can you order this for $39.99 a month on your credit card? I say do it. I say don't think twice about it. And you know what? When you get it home, use it for a month, hem a pair of jeans, do some courting, create some fun little project, and if you don't think that sewing is for you, you can always exchange or return it within 30 days for a complete refund. This is clothesline. What are you doing, darling? You know, this is clothesline, and I remember my grandmother used to bone. make those rugs yes. by hand. That looked very similar to this, and Catherine, our producer, just said her grandmother used to do that, too. Really? And so, in Your this day and age, this, we are so busy, and most of us don't have time for all of that intricate handwork, but isn't it nice that you can make something that brings back that nostalgic feel. Leave it to Singer to give you a machine that will sew through clothesline. You mean to do some? And no. <laughs> <laughs> I'll let you do something in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I know my Darlene. Yeah, well, like, you don't touch my dog bone, Matt. This is for Roxy. It's a little dog bone, Matt, and it's for her big, you know, she's got one of those big bowls with the water on one side, the food on the other. But, you know, you could take a jelly roll, you purchase them at the fabric store, they're two inches wide, you cut them in half, you wrap them around clothesline and pin it on there, and the next thing you know, you're making yourself, with a multi-stitch zigzag stitch, you're making yourself a rug, a table runner, so they maybe place fabric. mats, coasters, whatever size you want, you can make bowls, you can make vases, you can make anything you want out of clothesline. Now this is a quilting project. Now many of you might want to embark on a, some quilting, but this is National Craft Month and we appreciate the quilters in the world. And if you like to quilt, you can quilt on this machine. You have the different quilting feet that you would need. For example, you have the um, straight stitch foot that will give you a one quarter inch seam. So when you're piecing your pieces together, you would use this foot for quilting. And then when you go to do that top stitching or the stippling or some of that top stitching you just saw on the sewing machine quilt, you use this foot. And this is one of the feet that comes
come with the machine. In fact, I'm going to show you that one next. I'm going to hop over to the machine on the other side of the set and Great. show you how easy it is to do free motion work with a with a Singer mechanical machine, something unheard of years ago. You know, I ran my own business for 15 years. I was a costume designer in this area, and I have to tell you, I had a mechanical machine that I paid $250 for. It only had five stitches. This one has 23, by the way, and it only came with one foot. So this is a great, great deal, and you can start a cottage industry. Now, this is where you will make the little feed dog. Those feet that pull the, the little fingers that pull the fabric through, you're going to make them fall down. So now that you can see them nice and close, I'm going to make them drop. Ready? Here they go. Do you see them drop? Do you see them go? Which is boom. They just boom, drop down. Now you might be wondering why is she dropping those feet down? Well, because we want the free motion. We don't want to be fighting against the feet pulling on the fabric as we stitch on our canopy here. So now you place, you still, you, I put on the darning and free motion embroidery foot, the mm -hmm. one that you said, what's the name of that foot? That's this one here. Okay. And it has a hole in it. And your, your needle is going to go through that hole, but the circumference around the hole is what holds the fabric ah. in place. It gives it its stability so that you can Very sew. Very interesting. Yeah. <laughs> okay, no. with everyone shopping, I should re remind you that we started with about 1,300 of these machines. And right now, with everyone shopping, there are well below 1,000 remaining. So, And we've got several hundred people that are ordering. This is your chance to have this machine only for the next 17 minutes on five flex payments for $39.99. It is a value because it's the true commercial grade heavy duty singer machine. Big customer pick, read the reviews at hsn.com and also it's free, free, free shipping. Look nice. at you go. Well, look at the machine go. You know, this sews faster than a regular sewing machine and it, weigh, it weighs in at about 17 pounds. It's an aluminum frame, so it's metal, but it's still nice and strong. So you're not going to have all the skip stitches. You're going to have precision and you'll be able to do all all of your stippling with this as well. So there you saw I added some lighter green uh, thread in with the dark green thread. And you have the pillow right there, Bill, if you'd hold that up Look and show pillow. our viewers. Look at how beautiful. I mean, this is like a pillow that you'd spend maybe $100 or more for. You, so you first embellish the um, inside pieces that I just showed you. And after all that embellishment is done, you change your thread and you can use embroidery thread and you do a satin stitch, which is a zigzag, very, very tight and close together. And then that will finish off the edges. And it's absolutely stunning. Just a beautiful tropical uh, kind of a paradise look, isn't it? I love that. And look what else you can do. Look at the back of this pillow. Hidden zipper closure. Yep. These are the things you find with couture clothing and also with really fine decorative pieces. Oh, yes. See, hidden zipper closure. I mean, this is nice. Okay. You can do this. Mm -hmm. And you can do this when you just start sewing. And you need ready, set, sew, too. You need to have that uh, guide. Oh, that's good, too. Listen, I'm going to make a, a suggestion. Get them all. Get home, make one little teeny project. Make, make a napkin. Make a napkin. And pick stitch it and see if you can do it. Make a napkin. Don't go far. Just a square. Don't do pleated drapes with swags and everything. Do something for your scrapbooking. One little project. Sewing Make a little on matting. paper. You can sew on paper uh, and cardstock and vellum and, with this machine. Cardboard. Wait till you see. what Darlene's going to teach you so much on her blog. You're going to be out of your mind now. Fewer than 900 remaining with everyone shopping. Five flex this hour only. I don't want you to get nervous. I want you to get excited. Get on that HSN shopping app and go, oh, yes. As a matter of fact, you know what? If you ordered our Today Special, or if you didn't order our Today Special, you get the computer and you get the Android tablet. Yes. You can order. When you get that, you're going to use that Android tablet right there on your coffee table to use the HSN shopping app. It's going to be a blast. And you can also, you know, write to Darlene on her email. She'll answer your emails about projects. And Facebook. And Facebook. Now, Darlene, is it Darlene Cahill on HSN? or just Darlene Cahill? Just Darlene Cahill. Okay, Darlene Cahill. And then if you have a problem for whatever reason, write to me on Facebook. I forward mm -hmm. her several emails because right. we kind of work together on this. So it's Bill Green on HSN. Or you okay. can do that. So it's Bill Green on HSN. Friend me, like me, whatever they call yes, it. Yes, friend me, like me, please. Tweet me, <laughs> like me, pin me. <laughs> Take a look at this. Now, you were talking about couture sewing. And yes, you can start off with this as a beginner. This is great for all seasons, all sexes, all ages, no matter what you want to sew, but you can take it to this level. We have this here to inspire you that, yes, with the 22 built-in stitch patterns, you can make decorative trims. You did just see buttonholes. You can attach your own buttons if they have eyes in them, at, like 
as demonstrated on this yellow a linen top. You can do the twin needle top stitching. All you have to do is pick up a twin needle. This machine, yes, will accommodate it. You can do all of your channel stitching with that straight stitch foot and make beautiful rows that are nice and even. You can sew denim, as you see here in the denim jacket that's right next to this, um, this faux suede purse. So all of these heavy materials, the heavy duty things in your life, whether you're making a vase out of uh, fabric with the heavy Timtex inside, whether you're making that rope bowl or coaster or placemat or uh let's see what else vase oh, I love the, some of the runners you've done for the holidays table runners yeah. or if you want to do something this. like a cover for your toaster oven or, or even sewing rattan and wicker you'll be able to sew that look at that beautiful zigzag it's a it's actually a stretch zigzag so it's doubled over it's a double zigzag so it's nice and bold you'll be able to acquire those kind of results when, when you, you have this, this machine are these cute or what they're cute or what these are are like fabric vases that are filled with those glass marbles, those glass beads. Look, and then you just put your silk flowers in there. I mean, just for something cute for a housewarming gift, do a collection of them. Look, if you want to make a little decorative pillow, take remnants of fabric or go to the fabric store. You can buy remnants of fabric and ribbon like this and, you know, um, make a pillow like that for pennies where this would cost you $25 if you went into like a little True. You know, home deck store. You're right. But this is it. You only have the next, what is it? 12 minutes and 32 seconds to get this home for $39.99 because it is on five flexible payments on any major credit card only through the end of this hour. It is free shipping and it's the lowest price we've ever offered on the heavy duty commercial grade sewing machine from Singer and it's a customer pick. Now watch, you're gonna let me sew, right? Oh my gosh. Oh my, I won't break a needle, I promise. Okay, here we go. <laughs> So okay. what, I, I've never done this, yeah, so I'll do I know, it carefully. That's okay. You're going to hold these three. This is the cording foot, and okay. it allows you to make three-dimensional embellishments by running embroidery floss. I'll be careful. So I have some metallic embroidery floss, some metallic aqua, and then metallic uh, gold again. So you hold them separately, nice and lightly. You can even separate them like this in your fingers, like this, so that they're I in a different place. I promise you. Right? I give you my word it'll be flawless. Okay. And then I'm going to make that stitch length even a little bit so shorter. So I should hold them a little afar, apart from one another, right? right? You just want to keep them in the right order, like right, oh, center, left. Oh, easy. Yeah. Okay. And, and, don't, and slow. No, and, yeah. don't, and don't press the gas. That's right. Press the gas, but not too hard. There you go. Nice job. Now, Bill's using the cording foot, running three cords this through. This is Mr. Green. With a decorative stitch. So you can literally make... Okay, stop. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to turn you this around. How I, I stopped when she said stop, but I was going to stop anyway. She always yells at me for going past. Well, you're a foot. speed demon on Look these things. Look at this. No, you know what? You could not do this with just any old tired machine. That's and, the cool part of this. Or, or any... <laughs> no, never mind. I'm not even going to say that. What? Okay. No, what? I was going to say, and you're never tired because um, I know you're drinking coffee, and that's why you're always a speed demon. <laughs> so now come drink the... Now come do this side. Come on. Come do this side, Bill. Go ahead. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Right away. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Is she a teacher? You should see when I was in her shop, we and she so was teaching fun. me how to sew... I thought, I went home, I had such a headache because I, she taught me so much. I could, did a lot. Well, I did. You really, it was, I was like, okay, you know, roll over hem, this hem, that hem, blinds, the, I was going crazy. Okay. Here okay. But you made a beautiful apron. I and did. And that's the thing. You stitched some memories with me. We got some great photos from the day. Now, if I make a mistake, it's because you're hitting me in the hip. Oh, okay. okay. Hold on. Go I'm ahead. Stop. You're doing great. Let me separate the threads and not braid. This is not a braiding treatment. No. Okay. Hold on. Although it could it could look like one. Now go ahead and keep sewing. I just have to grab the. I can okay. separate the threads. I know, but we're waiting. It's live TV. I know. Really? <laughs> now you know the stress. I'm always. What was my first know. clue twenty years later that this is our live television? All right, come on, keep going. Okay, I'm going. Doing okay. great. Please don't hit my hip again. I will knock the threads out. I'm of sorry. That was my fault. There you go. You're doing great. That looks so pretty. Okay, now let's take a look at the results. Ladies and gentlemen, Ta -ta -ta, take your final bow, Mr. Bill Green. Mr. Green has just embellished a piece of what Ooh, is that? Ooh, that's pretty. Piece of fabric. Piece of fabric. <laughs> it's a piece of. Now here's what you, I want you to know. When you stabilize fabric, here's another tip. <laughs> Make sure you iron on a nice woven stabilizer. Don't just try to do something like this on regular fabric. You're going to get all puckers and wonder what happened. You always have to stabilize when you're doing decorative work and surface embellishments. So remember that. Bill did a great job. This was the domino stitch over three different pieces can I, can of I, embroidery cloth. Can I cloth? share with you that you are the best teacher? And that money can buy. You're so sweet. And, and this I'm not is playing. the courting foot. There you see the three. See those three little channels right there? That's where the cord slips in. Those three little holes. And you just slip it in right there on the side. 
It just slips right under, it snaps in place. You can hear it snap. And then once those are in place, you just choose the decorative stitch that you want, you stitch uh -huh. right over them, and you get beautiful, unusual results. You know, I told you at the beginning of the hour that I, you know, we don't have crystal balls here in this business. We really don't. But I know our customers, I just, it's like we mind meld. Those of you at home that know me, that I've shopped with for many, many years, I feel like you and I mind meld together. Aww. And when I tell you that I believe that this machine could sell out in this hour, I was not kidding you. Now, we started this hour with a brand new order of 1,300 of the heavy-duty machines, but it was never scheduled to be at 199.95. It was going to be 249 because it's craft month. They knocked it down to 199.95. This is big. The five flex payments was a little bit of like fairy dust from our planning department. They just kind of sprinkled it over our graphics. So and nice. Put it on five flex payments so that you know what? You don't have to stress. It's like a dollar and a few pennies a day, and that's only good for the next eight minutes and six seconds. Oh my gosh. So you have to order it now. Do not be gun shy. If you've always wanted to sew and your mom sew, like maybe sewed when you were a kid, and you were like, I want to sew when I grow up, and you never took up the, the art because, you know, life got into the fast lane. You had children. You got married. You had children. It was busy. Slow down and smell the roses and sew something, and you're going to feel so accomplished oh, yes. when you make that little pair of curtains for the French doors in the bedroom or the or the kitchen or the, or the window curtains or a shower curtain or a costume for your daughter or your granddaughter for Halloween. You're going to feel like super grandma if you're a grandmother and you do that. Now I'm taking off the foot and the shank. Typically you just pull this back lever and it would release the foot and you just snap on another foot. But right now I want to remove the entire shank because two of the feet in your foot bundle will need to be applied with a screwdriver. So now this has a shank of its own. I'm going to slip it on over. And I'm so happy I have time to do this. I don't usually have the luxury of this time. I'm slipping it on the shank. Hold on, I'm making room. There it is. And then you'll want to make sure that you tighten it with your little skate key screwdriver because I want to show off this is called a gathering foot and a gathering foot is easy to use but it's going to save you so much time because if you've ever tried to hand gather oh my gosh it's such a pain because if you pull the thread the wrong way mm, you um, have to start all over again okay now what you want to make sure is that when you start the um, thread is down underneath the machine mm -hmm. underneath the foot so I do one turn of the hand wheel Pull that thread through. See how both of them are going down and out the back? Right. Okay. That was now, a mistake I made there. I'm glad you just repeated This is rolled hemmed. We rolled hemmed this prior to the show. And I'm just going to take this little piece of fabric and place it here. Now, I'm going to start on a straight stitch. And I'm going to have my stitch length long, around three to four. My width is going back to the center. And I'm going to start with a pull down reverse. This is the reverse button right here. So you're going to start stitching. You stitch, reverse, and stitch, and make my tension go all the way to nine. So see the tension button? Go all the way to nine, nice and tight. And now watch what happens. Woo! Oh my God, you're rooshing. I am automatically auto rouge gathering <laughs> this piece of fabric it is auto rouge i like that it's a new app with the singer heavy duty machine <laughs> it auto rouge only with singer okay there that. are fewer now listen to this craziness oh, there are did. fewer than 550 remaining nice. I want you to get it before it's gone. We have five minutes and 30 seconds to shop on five flex payments for $39.99. If your daughter just graduated high school and she has a natural affinity to be a fashion designer, and that's what she's doing. After high school or college, she's going to fashion school, and you're sending her to New York to specialize in fashion and design. She is going to love this machine. She can do so much with it. From I mean, if she wants to be a costume designer, Help her to fulfill that dream. Start her with the machine that she really will love using to do some of the basics and then graduate into the more sophisticated sewing treatments later on. It's called the Singer Heavy Duty for a reason. No challenge is too big for this machine. I didn't even cover this with you. Shame on me. Uh, you're going to receive this machine with a great... Uh, uh, what do you call it? Warranty. It's a 51525. They mm. give you a 25-year warranty on the motor. You experience a problem, you call, you know, Singer, they hook you up, they put a new motor in, and they don't ask any questions. And you nice. know what? That's really important for you to know. Plus, you're getting the value-added accessories, 23 uh, built-in stitch patterns. This is the lowest price and also the best flex payment with free shipping we offer because it's National Craft Month. In just a fraction of a second, 800 will be gone. We have several hundred of you ordering. I told you after the show, probably a couple of hours after the show, whatever residual quantity we've got will probably
probably be gone, and then maybe, I told you it could sell out. It could sell out, though. I mean, if you get on the phone now, take advantage of that flex pay. But some people don't care about flex pay. I don't know anybody that doesn't, but some people don't care about getting it on flex pay, and they'll just buy it, you know, without the flex pay or something. But here's the deal. This is just one of the many things you can do. I'm just doing some decorative stitching. I love surface embellishment, and you're going to enjoy the surface embellishments that you'll be able to accomplish with this machine. And if it's just functional, that's fine. This is the machine that my husband, my son, it's our their go-to machine has always been the Singer Heavy Duty. Why? It's non-intimidating, easy learning curve. You practically plug it in, six seconds later you have it threaded, and then you are playing. It is easy to okay, use, I'm taking simple over. to operate. I swear to you, I won't make a mistake. Easy to understand. I promise you, I give you my word. <laughs> See, he's got bit by the sewing bug now. Well, and because you just, let me start. Now I've got you. Gotta let I know. Me. Now you just really want to do it. Okay, I'll tell you what. We'll uh, jump over here. Uh, okay. All right. I'm going to jump to the outside. I'll tell you what. We'll do it right there. Another? So you, you, okay. this is what I want you to look at. Most what? people look at the needle, and that's a mistake, and they're always drunk drive, and they watch don't understand why. You need to watch the outside of the foot and its relationship to the outside of that circle. apple. Okay, and you're going to you go it. in that circle, okay? Okay. We're going to make that a nice, wide, beautiful crescent stitch go. Okay, watch okay, Mr. So Green. Still so in circles. Now, this is the perfect wedding gift. This is for that new couple that just got an apartment, just bought their new home, just getting that new uh, dorm, maybe they're going off to college to empower someone to be able to transform those soft goods around them is a gift that really you can't put a price tag on i don't want to sound silly but if i can do this any woman any guy at home can do it and if you're thinking you know what you want to be in the design world you want to be in all maybe you want to open up a, an alteration shop if, if I mean, repairing things and at home. And upcycle things you already have. How many of us have a laundry basket full of old clothes that have something wrong? It's got a stain. It's got a rip. It's, it doesn't fit right. That sleeve's too long. It's well, you know too what? Short. Your dog jumped on top of your quilt yeah. and tore a hole in it, and you want to do a fun little quilted, quilting patch on it. Right. You can applique and cover it up. I mean, when you can harness those soft goods around you, harness the power from the Singer machine, and be able to transform them into unique, one-of-a-kind items, things that reflect yourself, your personality, your lifestyle, things that you love and believe in and cherish. I mean, all of that and so much more are the kind of... God, results. I'm good. You did a great <laughs> job. I'm not done yet. You're following the edge of the foot. Okay, You'll now, have to I'm stop when you hit the, the little yellow guy. You'll can I not go stop. over it? No, you can move him up out of the way, though. Oh, I can? Yeah. Okay. Just tell him to, you know. No, I'm not.